Okay, let me explain about what we've been doing here with Dylan. Um, so we got four uh, microphones here, Gefels UM70s. They're the main pairs, really. And then here we have two, uh, well, uh, one by binaural head. We got four um, microphones of percussion here, small diaphragm condensers. And then we have the bird whistle here, which are two C12s. And then next to it, we have here the drunker percussion. And the drunker percussion is two MKH40s. Um, and then next to that, we got a harp, uh, sorry, harmonium, and we got a kick drum. And then also we have here a flute, and then we have some spare channels here for the trombone. Okay, let me show you. Let me show you what's here. We basically extended the um, the cabling here to the back of the building. Um, okay, so let's have a look here. We got here the main pairs of UM seventies on the six nine one body. And they sound just wonderful. They're in um, cardioid, and then we have here the binaural head which is connected with a little quarter-inch jack and it goes down on the floor to a couple of DIs. Now here's the harmonium. We got two uh, C3000s, as you can see here, and these are the servos that, um, that trigger the harmonium. And here we have a flute, which has another uh, C3000. And over here is the drunk of percussion. We kept it quite wide with the stereo. It is two MKH40s, so it's nice and wide in the stereo field. And these are the servos. So here we got the bird whistle, uh, two C12s, as you can see. And this is the controller box for it. It's triggered with a USB and it goes to a computer. These are all the servos and the, uh, the relays for it. As you can see here, you can see the motors that spin the bird whistle. So here's the uh, 406, Sennheiser 406 for drum. Uh, the snare drum here triggered by a servo a robot on the side there. And over here, we have a KM184, uh, which um, we put for the gong and sort of split out in four separate percussion settings. Um, here's another one, another KM184, nice bright microphone, uh, which works really nicely on this percussion. And here on the kick drum, we actually put in a, um, a Sennheiser, sorry, not a Sennheiser, a Ships, uh, and the Ships is a CMC5 with a um, hypercardioid capsule on it. We just want to need a little bit more clarity on the kick drum, so we just stuck a small diaphragm in there. And then Dylan here, he's got his uh, little mixer and the mixer, he's got a couple of mics on. So here's one of them. This is the microphone that comes so that of course the kick drum. And on this side here, we have another microphone for a bit more tech for him. And he all feeds that into his mixer, which is very exciting. And then uh, he also adds in the harmonium. So that all goes to the mixer too. He's very close up here. All goes to the mixer too. Uh, goes to the mixer and then he has a little delay pedal um, and he balances it together and then it comes out of these uh, these large JBL sort of feed back into the room and into the microphones. It is sort of the nerve center of the uh, of his operation. All right, I think that sums it up. <laughs> 